Every time I go on a YouTube to look up real estate market or look up something about the real estate business, all I've been seeing lately is Zillow, 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 Zillow. Is this something we as real estate agents actually need to be worried about or not? Well, let me tell you guys. What's up everyone, I'm Brandon. I'm a real estate agent here in Los Angeles County and thank you so much for checking out this video. If you haven't done so already, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. Leave me a like, leave me a comment. It does help grow the channel. So let's get into this video. So Zillow is quickly becoming everybody's favorite topic to talk about, and with good reason. They just became their brokerage. I know you've probably heard about that. They just bought Showing Time for 500 million. I mean, these guys are now sitting on some real capital. They are making a dent in this real estate business. They are also, if you wanna sell your house, you could call Zillow and just sell it directly to them for cash, quick close. No problem. But I do think agents are kind of psyching themselves out and really worrying for no reason. If you are providing excellent customer service to your clients, if you are putting in the work to grow in this industry, you're gonna be fine. Let's talk more. Real estate is and always has been a people pleasing business. And I don't think that just because Zillow is around that that's realistically gonna change. At the end of the day, people do like to deal with people. Zillow can never eliminate that. People are always going to want to have a real estate agent during the transaction. With that in mind though, you as the real estate agent, you need to be prepared to adapt. Those who are willing to adapt, you're gonna be fine. But if you are over there freaking out, you're so worried about Zillow putting you out of business, you, my friend, are going to be the agent that gets worked out of this business. But why is everyone only talking about Zillow? I mean, Redfin's been doing everything that Zillow's working towards for a while. Like buying and selling homes. Redfin, that's nothing new. They've been doing that. The brokerage, hello, Redfin's been around for years and they're way ahead of where Zillow's at. They already have agents that are out there showing property and selling property. I even know some agents that are big in the market that work for freaking Redfin. So why is everybody so you know worrying about Zillow? Redfin's been doing this for years. Redfin's out there buying and selling property. They have agents that are out there showing, helping people buy and sell real estate. What else are they doing? Oh, they actually provide leads to agents just like Zillow, except they do things a little differently. Zillow, you have to pay for every month unless you're part of Zillow's flex program that they just started which is pretty much the same thing as Redfin. Zillow Flex eliminates the monthly bill and you only pay at closing of a lead and you pay a 35% referral fee. What does Redfin do? Redfin, you pay a 30% referral fee when you close a lead. You don't pay monthly fees either. How is that any different from what Flex is doing? These are, they're, they're the same. You guys are so worried about Zillow, you're not thinking about Redfin that's already doing all this. Redfin is active in our market and they haven't even made a freaking dent. They are nothing to be concerned about, yet for some reason you guys are so concerned about Zillow because they bought showing time. Truth is Zillow's not going anywhere. They're gonna be here for you know, next five years, next 10 years, next 15 years, and hey, who, who's to say in you know, over time, all of us won't be working for Zillow eventually. No one has a crystal ball, no one knows what the future's gonna tell, but I can tell you this. If you are willing to put in the time, put in the hours, provide excellent customer service for your clients, you are going to be fine. Zillow is nothing to be afraid of. Zillow is something for us to embrace. I do think the more we as agents try and fight it, it's gonna fight back just as hard. So the best thing we can do is just welcome it. Work together to help clients get the best service humanly possible. Like I said, Redfin's been around. They're already doing this. They haven't made a significant dent in our market. Zillow isn't gonna make a significant dent in our market either. So all the agents that are so worried, oh my gosh, what's gonna happen, what's gonna happen, nothing. Redfin hasn't made a dent, Zillow's not gonna make a dent. At the end of the day, buyers, sellers still like to deal with people. This is a people-pleasing business. This is a people business. Buyers and sellers wanna deal with people. They don't wanna deal with a robot. They don't wanna deal with some giant company. They like dealing with one person. That's been around for years, decades that isn't going away anytime soon. So I don't think you need to be spinning your wheels, worrying about stuff that doesn't matter. You need to be focused on providing the best service for your clients and going out there and telling other clients, telling other buyers and sellers that you provide excellent service. Focus on that, not on Zillow. Best of luck to you guys. Let's crush it in 2021.